If your speedrun of choice supports load removal or auto splitting, or maybe you just want to check, start by right clicking live split, click edit splits, then make sure you have the game name typed in and the appropriate category you're going to be running. This decides how it fetches the load remover from the live split repo. And if you do have one, then you can click activate. If your load remover or auto splitter has any possible configurable settings, you can click settings. And this is what a load remover slash auto splitter looks like. I can configure all my chapters. However, not every game will have this supported. So it really is just dependent upon what game you are playing. Since you are using load removal, you will want to make sure your timer is displaying for in-game time rather than real time. Start by right-clicking live split again. Find compare against in the menu and then click game time. If you go to do a run and you happen to notice that it is still always running even when your game is paused, then it's possible that you need to go to edit layout, go to layout settings, and then under split, scroll all the way down and make sure that your comparisons for your columns are either set to current comparison, or if you want to customize it even further, you can manually set it to game time or real time here. However, this will override any other setting you make. So just set it to current comparison if you want to be able to change it from the menu here or with your hotkey. If your game of choice either is not under the edit splits menu, or maybe you are trying to build your own and want to manually test one, you can go to edit layout, add an item, and under control, add a scriptable auto splitter. Then under layout settings, you can browse for the file location that you have left your experimental auto splitter ASL script. If your game is not supported under the edit splits menu, you may also want to consider submitting your auto splitter or load remover to the live split GitHub repo. Currently, any game that is added under there will show up under the edit splits menu and it will make it easier for everyone else if it is readily available from there.